was really cool seeing the Jaguar up close and they told us that that is something that only you will get with Adventures by Disney that they do not offer that to anyone else it is only for Adventures by Disney what did you think of seeing the Jaguar up close like that awesome it was pretty cool it was pretty cool all right now it's time for lunch Good morning. How are you doing? Good. Yeah. Isn't this the best? They pick up the luggage for us oh, yeah. right. <laughs> right from our room. You guys are awesome. <laughs> so seriously, Adventures by Disney is the best. That part of picking up the luggage for you, all we have to do is get the luggage out of the room at a certain time, a little early this morning, 7.30 this morning, but still, you get the luggage out the door and then you don't have to worry about anything. I do the quick sweep and then we go to breakfast. We just have our day backpacks. All we have to do is like walk out the door <sighs> for mommies and daddies. Isn't that the best? Awesome. Seriously. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Today we are going to go grab some breakfast and then we're going to Grand Canyon. Mom, you're going the wrong way. Okay. We're going to breakfast. Probably gonna see a bunch of other people from the uh, group. But uh, after that, we're gonna go to the shuttle and we're on our way to the Grand Canyon. So what is your, what are you most excited about today? Um, seeing a, uh, what's it called? Bighorn sheep. Bighorn sheep to get $10, cause we bat. Bitted. Mommy's getting it first. Mommy's already talked to the guides to let me know when they see it so I can win. No. <laughs> it wasn't a big sheep, it was a mountain goat. Those are different things. No, big sheep. Sorry. Oh, you said mountain goat design. It's, 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 ma it's, it's because I saw the sign and I thought the sign was a big, was a mountain goat. But it's not. It's actually, it's a big horn sheep. I saw a sign with big horns and I thought it was a mountain goat, but it's not. It's, it's called a big horn sheep in Zion. Yeah. <laughs> so we're keep, we're keeping an eye out for a big horn sheep. Hunter got this awesome smoothie in a bowl. But it's supposed to have granola in it, but I didn't know it. Do you know what the green part is? Avocado. Yes, and what else? Kale. Oh, you do know? Did it gross you out that it's kale and spinach for breakfast? When um, I eat it, I feel like I'm like, ew, this is a bit, this place is a bit worse now that I know what's in it. <laughs> You're gonna be strong like Popeye. <laughs> it's not show time yet. Show time? It's not show time yet. My fiestas are getting Jota and Jota. <laughs> if you don't get the reference, it's from Tiki Room. Chen and Tiki Room. And the Tiki 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 Room. There's our bus. It's show time. All aboard. It's show time. That looks Is that a good like, color? It looks kind of like Hunter's hair. Or some more like Hunter's hair? <laughs> It looks like your dreadlocks. It looks like your dreadlocks. It smells like my dreadlocks too. It smells like your dreadlocks. I'm just kidding. Yeah. We are here. Bearzona. Are you excited? <laughs> the first thing we're doing is a show. It's a raptor free show. Raptor free flight show. Don't know what that means, but it looks like fun. Uh, that, yes, that's a great horned owl. We used to have one of those in our yard. We did? Yeah. I want, I want an owl. You want an owl? Yes. I want you want to hold a snake or a bird, yes. and you want an owl. In the a a pet owl, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Quick reminder what she's coming up that um, that when the birds fly, we do ask that you do keep your hands down and don't try to kind of reach up or anything. Yeah, just right up here on stage. Yeah, great. And your name is? What was that? Hunter, thank you, Hunter, for volunteering. We're gonna have you come over here and take a seat on our fake rock. <laughs> and Hunter, are you from, where are you from? Florida. From Florida, all right, cool. Well, this is no longer just Hunter from Florida. 
This is now Hunter the mouse from Florida. And actually, Hunter, at this point, we're all mice. These are now your aunts and uncles, cousins, brothers and sisters. We're going to pretend it's, well, it is summer, and it's the middle of the night. The eating's still pretty good, but it seems like every night more owls trying to get us. Now, Hunter's a smart mouse. She wouldn't be out at 2 in the morning sitting in a clearing like a target. Hunter, you'd probably be under a rock or a bush, so you'd hear the owl approach, but you'd probably never see it. So to reenact that, Hunter is going to put on a blindfold. All right, can you see? Good, that's probably for the best. Now, <laughs> since you're no longer a person, you're now a mouse, Hunter, you can't talk anymore. You're going to have to squeak to warn us. Would you like to practice squeak? That was good. That was good. Um, could everybody hear? Could you guys in the back hear Hunter okay? Go ahead and try it one more time, a little more squeak. <laughs> okay, that was pretty good, yeah. All right, well, we're going to go with that. Now, we're almost ready, but here at Arizona, we're really safety conscious. We're working with some of the largest avian predators on Earth. These are Eurasian eagle owls. They don't get much bigger. So we have some required head protection for Hunter. <laughs> this is required headwear for all volunteers. <laughs> all right, Hunter, safety first. Hunter, when you hear that owl coming to get us, you, of course, are going to squeak to warn us. Here we go. Oh, Hunter, that was a whisker too late. She's, um, she's finishing you off right now, but that's okay. You can go ahead and take off your blindfold and look above you there. Isn't she beautiful? Well, I think we all enter a round of applause. She sacrificed her hope for me like this new the rest of us. They're physically larger than your eyes are. As a matter of fact, they are so large, they take up more room in her skull than her brain does. Look at this cool bus we're hopping on. I've seen videos. Oh, I got some, some bison treats here. Oh, awesome. Ooh. Bison. They bison look, like, treats? The llama treats we had the or, other day. or you can eat them and have a really bad experience. I'll try it. I'll do it. You would. Your choice. You would totally try it, wouldn't you? I would. We're going to go check out some animals. So oh, excited! Yeah. You've got like a whole stash of food going on over here. <laughs> Are you hoarding it? <laughs> you want to hear me okay? Yeah. yeah. Do you want to make our future water can actually look no, over your did you see it? See the bottoms of the did you see it first? I think and there was no. a little gas wagon bug. No, no way. And a wheelie yes. under the rock. Oh, I did. Rocking on goats. We've got animals. Oh. Hunter saw it first. I get ten dollars. He still is. Hunter if you saw look it first. All the way to the right, guys. It's your all first the way over there. Back over here in the corner. It's Gustus. Dude, she found <laughs> the mountain goat first. Ah, so there it is, right there. Now the Rocky Mountain goats are known as being the most sure-footed critters on the North American continent. Ah, so you're not. I can't to believe you found it first. Line. We are bringing the reindeer into this area. What? Yep. Reindeer. Or caribou. Yeah, reindeer, caribou, whichever you prefer. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Waffles. This is where you want to remember to keep your arms and any other appendages you'd like to keep inside the bus. This is the Alaskan Tundra Wolf. We're going to be looking for four. Now our survival rate's up to like 73% right now. So I really need you guys to help me out. That's a great number, isn't it? Yeah. We do have somebody in the middle of the road. I see one. Is that Kay and Geronimo? Just kidding. And over here on the right hand side, up on the right, is Victorio. This is the Alpha. Oh, was Shadow back there? I didn't miss him, did I? I don't think so. Oh, here he is, aptly named. His name should be Rock today. He looks like a rock. Are we going to try to howl? Are we going to do it? Yeah. You can't just give one. You got to keep going for a minute. Go. from their back out there, but Peanut's the close one. The little bears that you'll see on the other side of the fence are in timeout. So Peanut, oh, this is Tesla or Tulsa. Little rescues out of, actually, that's Katie, isn't it? Resc I'm not doing very good with my bears this morning. I need Even though it looks pretty cute, a lot of times that means something's wrong. Okay? So still healthy and happy right now. We keep our eyes out. We do what we can do. 
But you are going to see a big difference in the colors between those white babies. Now, the white babies will not get darker as they get older. The color they are, they're going to stay. It's the red brown bison baby that will get darker as he gets older. <laughs> Get there? I did it on the head. Oh. <laughs> Look at the little white baby just got up. So, so you've got white, you've got brown, you've got white. Yeah, normally going to top off at about 2,000 in the wild. <laughs> oh, they're like, food! Oh, wow. Baby. Food time! Oh, <laughs> Holy moly, look at the little ones! Wow, look at the horns on that guy. Yeah. Notice that lovely mohawk. <laughs> She's sporting. We've got a junior bear in here, Mo. He got his name Mo because he has the best mohawk in the park. Yep, what we're going to do is just start with one until oh, everybody goes. Cold. We're just going to throw them in and then keep it. moving a little bit, okay? So everybody can, I can see them in the corner. The old hey, boy, come here. Oh, All right, guys, oh, so after God. you throw, watch out. We're going to start with one, okay? And then we're probably going to have an opposite too. Oh, so guys, after you throw, hey, step throw one, step aside. aside. And then stay close to the line the left over, okay? okay? So this is Louis, Isaac, and Juan. Louis and Isaac are brothers of one year, uh, not one year, but one in captivity. Uh, Juan is a rescue from Barbara Lake and Phoenix. This is They're actually in the middle of nine months. So yeah, quick thing, yes, in the water. I don't know, roll up in a ball, but you know, she just wants to do something. But he's a black jaguar. Is there another name you like that? Panther. Panther, you nailed it. Yeah, You're getting you real good today, aren't you? <laughs> so he is a panther. Now, panther is really just a general marketing large black cat. There's no specific species of panther. There are snakes that like to eat them, but little snacks for the deer as well. One thing we're training him here is target training. He comes up, he touches the little buoy, he gets a reward comes up, touches it again, he gets a reward for it. And then we might ask him to start teaching him new things. A lot of times he comes up and touches it. Maybe he's going to come up and touch it in the hand. It was really cool seeing the jaguar up close and they told us that that is something that only you will get with Adventures by Disney, that they do not offer that to anyone else. It is only for Adventures by Disney. What did you think of seeing the jaguar up close like that? Awesome! It was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. Alright, now it's time for lunch. <laughs> Fancy pants dance up Arizona! That's kind of what the snake was doing. Did you see the snake all wiggling around? I think the snake was doing the fancy pants dance. I feel like you're keeping a secret like someone's playing a snake on me. We finally found the javelinas. We ate their There's one right there. Well, two, there like they are. One, two, three, four. We've been looking for them this whole time. They have a lot of them here in Arizona and Utah. Mm -hmm. What do you think of the javelina? Is that what you expected? No, not all of them. Okay, I, I thought they'd be a little bit smaller. They're pretty big. I thought they were going to be a bit smaller too. I see goat. Hey goat. I got it. I'm afraid to go behind it. <laughs> You're afraid to go behind it? Yeah. Here, go just go like this. Just say, excuse me goat. Excuse me goat. Hello goat, we're coming through. We're coming through. There you go, <laughs> just sneak by his butt. Mm -hmm. He won't kick you. <laughs> <laughs> you just got taken out by the sheep and the goat. <laughs> that scared me to death. The sheep's like, my turf, back off. Alright, Hunter, do your gobble gobble. Mom. Oh, it's, little, little. It's, there you go. It's cheap oh. gobble. It's cheap. Oh, little, little. It's cheap I can't do it as well as you can. It's cheap ding gobble. So it started raining on us. But we're on the bus 